This is another source where durian lovers can find durian. Hundreds of kilos of durian are carried out by Orang Asli to this place every day. We continue our durian adventure in Hulu Langat. Customers at the durian stall in Kampung Kuala Pangsun at the foot of the Nuang Mountain come here to look for the so-called durian from the hill which they say have a natural taste. They said at the peak of the durian season in mid-July, the store was filled with fruits. The <laughs> place like this is very rare to see, because they have a promotion of durian bukit, right? Oh, durian bukit, it feels like it's tight. Strong sikit lah. Yeah, fresh. You can see dia punya dia punya buah memang semua fresh lah. Dia punya tangkai atas tu pun nampak fresh. Some customers are unaware that the durian they are eating are delivered by the durian growers from the Orang Asli community. Memang mereka bawa itu durian. Orang Asli yang bawa. Ah, oh. Kita memang baru tahu. Oh, yeah. oh okay, okay, okay. <laughs> The indigenous people live around the area and own farms on the mountain, which are planted with durian and other produce. They usually make two trips a day to bring their fruits to the durian stores to sell. Ya, yeah, kada separuh kita orang hantar rumah lah untuk makan sikit. Dan beli makan lepas tu separuh lagi buat jual lah. So, hari dia kadang-kadang tak uh, tak pasti juga. Kadang-kadang dia ada lebih Kadang sampai tiga trip, empat trip lah satu hari. Oh, mesti. Mesti kena ada jaga juga. Kita tak tahu binatang-binatang luar kan, atau hutan ni semua. Ah, macam tu lah. Nak tidur takut ambil kopek makan ni apa. Ah, sebab sini durian memang macam cantik semua. Jadi akad doyan pagi. Sudah pagi sudah oh, jual. Oh, pagi sudah jual. Ah, jual. Sekarang nak ah, pungut apa? Sekarang bawa naik lah. Mereka jaga ke, ke kebun. Ah, kebun. Kadang-kadang dapat 80. Ah, itulah kadang satu lato, kadang dua lato lah. Ada satu trip saja. Ah, pasal pagi, pagi saja. Ah, pagi saja. Pasal gayan kurang. Satu hari kalau kita bagi pukul rata daripada awal sampai habis, dia lebih kurang dalam dua tan satu hari lah. Jadi kalau musim dia empat puluh lima hari, memenuh sembilan puluh tan lah. Durian stall operator Ami Aisa said he had developed a good working relationship with the Orang Asli who would supply durian to him whenever they have fruits. Bila musim buah saja, dia jumpa saya. Orang lain datang masuk pun dia tak bagi. Sebab apa? Kalau dia bagi orang luar, dia sampai ujung, dia tak ambil. Dia ambil yang buah yang tengah-tengah saja. Tengok dia memerlukanlah. Kalau dia minta RM3,000, saya bagi RM3,000. Kalau dia minta sepuluh, saya bagi sepuluh. Sebab kadang-kadang dia bukan guna untuk untuk uh, jaga kebun saja. Anak dia nak kahwin, saya support lah. Tapi hutang tu saya tak minta. Saya tak potong. Sebab apa? Dia barang dia ada. Tiap-tiap tahun dia ada barang. The durian sold here might not taste better than the premium varieties and clones, but they are more affordable for all segments of society. Their natural yet unique taste is also some of the reasons why they are still much sought after. Frozen whole fruit is a new frontier. From the farm side, we have to produce export quality fruits. For the factories, we need to maintain a good standard. So I think the whole chain needs to work together so that it will be good for our durian industry.